Hey, what's up guys? This is Eric Moore with Torpedo Tenth Gaming, back for some revenge on the Binding of Isaac. I'm gonna start off here with Isaac this time. Last time I didn't even make it past the basement. Part 2, I don't think. So this time, how about we try for an entire of this? Well, up till mom. But, yeah, I've done it with Eve before. I think I can do this with Isaac. After all, Isaac is a very well-rounded character. He's got a pretty good skill, too. So, how about this kind of secret? Isaac is a pretty well-rounded character. He's got a pretty good skill. He's going to be, oh my god, Jack, where are you Disfigured Isaacs. Oh. Control bombs. Alright, so as far as I can tell, there are two rooms that could possibly be this time. And I've only got one Mr. Boom. So I'm going to go with this one. You can usually tell where a secret room is, but There's three rooms on the sides of it. Sometimes it's got four, but always it has three on the sides of it. So it's usually your best bet for trying to find a secret room. But secret rooms can be very valuable too. They can give you a bunch of money, and sometimes even the one up. So you can check it out. It's wonderful to five. Guys, I'm not that bad at this. I swear. Stop. Stop it. Don't doubt me. I hate doubters. Just keep this to Oh my god, I pushed it the wrong way. Doesn't matter. Don't pull them anyway. That's exactly how it was soon actually. It's okay. But I know what I'm doing. I'm professional. There's a new kind of room with a catch to this that I'm not sure that I've explained, so I guess I'll do that after I finish off all of the creepy, zombie, bloody eyed. Because that room is a, a gauntlet, or a, I've heard some people call it a mob trap room. But basically you go in, open a chest, take whatever's inside, and then the gate closes and you have to fight whatever uh, whatever spawns. There's three waves of spawns and then it drops whatever you want to drop. Like a heart. So maybe I'll be able to show one off. 
but I'm not I'm sure. I'm not even sure. I'm not sure. Uh, I've got four hearts. Maybe I should If I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. I can't get it. Chest in here. We use the hanged man, which will give me the ability to fly. Chest? Wow. And it just fly right out of the room. If you've got uh, some kind of power up that lets you fly, you can also get into that room without having full health. It's, uh, it's nice, especially if there's a good item. Tears actually change in color depending on how much damage they do. Uh, red tears are some of the most powerful, I believe, but currently we don't have any tear effects, and that could definitely uh, help us out in the fight. Uh, so let's go fight the boss, see what he has to give us. It is. Famine! Should not be as hard as I make it, but he is. But with this awesome damage up, it should be easier. See? He's going to kill his own flies, too. As long as you don't get rammed by him. And he's Ooh, I wonder if we'll fight the head of the horse. It'd be nice to get the full name. Okay, get rid of his horse. Now just to not tank him. their names. The Horsemen of the Apocalypse, you get a cube of meat. Uh, a cube of meat will just orbit around you and, oh, look, it's a gift. And it's a wig! And all his friends laugh at him. Uh, the cube of meat orbits around you and can block any projectiles coming in. This is amazing. Look at all of them, they're so cute. Uh, the cube of meat will also damage any enemies it touches. Oh god. Awesome. Three new bombs. Let's go on in here, see if it's got anything cool. Uh, I don't want to waste my key. I want to save it for the item room. I don't think I've actually seen it. Alright, we got some flowers. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, got that one down. Ah, uh, goblins are cool. Battery, or it's a Bible, or a key. Uh, I'll take the battery and just assume that I'm going to get a really awesome item. So with the battery, I believe items recharge. Uh, not at double the rate, but they recharge based on how long you fight. So if it's particularly hard for you, you could, in theory, build up an item. Build up an item from this completely depleted state, all the way back up to the max. That's in theory, I don't think that would actually work. Facing these, uh, these creepy mini chub things. What would these things even be? Larva? I don't know. They're annoying though, so let's just blow them up.
I could certainly go for a trade with the devil. Alright. Happy flowers, hitting face with a basketball. And everyone laughs. Man, Isaac is such a happy kid. Alright, dog for pile. Crazy so far. Fire blood. Still.
And if you donate enough blood, ooh, no, it's nice. Sometimes the blood bank will explode. The blood bag. I really hope I can get it. Nope, just a bunch of money. Awesome. Flying on a spirit heart now. Well, let's see if I can buy anything cool from your store. Because I do have the money for it. Alright, ooh, a compass. Awesome. Please be something good. The magician is not something great. Good in a boss fight, but not for my purposes. Okay, so with the compass we can now see all the rooms of significance on the map, so I'm going to avoid going into this room here because it's got it's got a mini boss. money, which is 99 cents, and, uh, you unlock King, but, uh, wow, I don't really need any money. Oh, but I didn't need that either. Uh, you unlock Kane by going over, I think, 30 cents or something like that. Oh, sweet. Got Skatole. Skatole. Italian. Lila, we got a, a big pile of poops going around. Now, we can't take a single bit. Every week in Super Monday Night Combat, you get a roster of free to play pros, which are pretty much just the classes. Oh god, don't shoot! Which are just the classes. Over time, you'll. Oh, bad guys. Over 
time you'll uh, accumulate combat points, which will allow you to permanently buy your, uh, your pro of choice so that you don't have to wait for them to come up with two lines. Uh, however, if you do want to pay money, pay like uh, eight bucks, I think. You'll support Uber too, so you can definitely do it. Alright, pop up, get exploded. Oh, thank god I needed that so bad. Alright, kill you guys. Extremely aggressive. Stand in front of tactic. No, you wanna. Pop up! There we go. Oh, really? Pop up. There we go. Alright, now you're dead. And tarot card wheel of fortune. That really isn't worth anything to me. Fortune. The fortune spawns Slot machine. Alright, so Peep like pees all over the floor and it damage you or you walk on it. And then when he lands, uh, little, little balls of the uh, pits fly out of him to attempt to attack you. I've got this bomb here, hopefully it the and as Peep takes more and more damage, his eyeballs start coming out, wandering around the uh, room in an attempt to attack you. Uh, hopefully there won't be too big of a problem here. As Peep, why am I being so disgusting? I don't understand your limbs, too. Are those like little nubby legs? Or are you a bug? Alright, we get yet another HP upgrade. Wait for the peeps P to go away. Pick up that health, and let's go check out what Satan's got to offer. Alright, so I could give up two hearts for Brimstone, which essentially gives us the ability to fire a high power laser, or I could give up two hearts to get the Mart, which I think gives us. All, um, all stat boost or just damage, but I don't, I don't particularly like brimstone, so I'm gonna pick up the mark. There's superpower cards, damage. All right. Yeah, I can live with that. Super powerful Jesus with poo on his head that just happened to sell a few parts of the soul to the devil. Okay, I'm not gonna deal with that. Wow, you really want me to gamble, don't you? So, we've got another half a heart here. Oh, of course it's greed. Okay, well, at least we didn't come across some of the death cards here. Okay. Well, greed, uh, greed attacks will actually get rid of your money. It'll make it fly all over the ground. And you lose some of it, but when you kill greed, finish him off. Bunch of money for out of him, which is totally useless to me because I've got nice money. So let's just oh do some really stupid walking. Ah, okay. Mr. Boom. Uh, Mr. Boom has been a awesome. Mr. Boom has been a lot bigger help than I thought he'd be. Even without having a super powerful space bar I could replace him. It's another slot machine. Right, so let's go up over here. Oh, hi guys! What you up to? Not much. Alright, that's pretty cool. Alright, uh, so you and this little room. Alright, what are you? A skeleton key? Really? Oh, on the depths part one. Alright, a skeleton key gives you 99 keys, so I'm showing off a lot of uh, really rare items, but they're not of much use to me. I'm. I'm not doing this for the money, I swear. No, I actually, uh, I want to get the blood bag really bad, but... Uh, it seems that luck is not on the so I'm going to use my real fortune card and just play the slots until I get some hearts. I'm not going to have much left to spend on as long as I leave, like, 30 cents. I'll play my... Okay. I'm not going to sit here for... Oh, God, troll bomb. Oh! 
Grab yourself. Grab a couple bombs. I'm just gonna blow this thing up then. And a whole half heart. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Right, well, at least I've got these, uh, the faith hearts to act as a buffer. So I'm not totally SOL, but I, I could get to that, but I have a very high risk of damaging myself. Same thing for this one. Alright, so let's just make our way straight to the boss room and not get killed by the... Oh, awesome. First enemy to die from... Oh my god, I'm going to die. Run, 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 run. Okay. It's okay, I only took half a heart of damage. First enemy to die from the poison touch is in here now. Corruption coming in smear on that. And I hope it just flew away. Okay. Now, we've got the introduction of these crazy head things. Turrets. Whoa. You're not supposed to fire after the room ends. Oh god, not knights. Okay. These things, uh, you can only damage the back of their head. So, yeah, these things are kind of a gigantic pain to fight. Now, this, it would have been a good idea to get Brimstone if I'd known there would have been a lot of these guys, because Brimstone totally ignores their, uh, their facial defenses. Well, well, Alright, I suppose that works. Ooh! And here we have a little beggar boy, who, if you give enough money, will drop an item for you. Now, you just gotta be careful not to kill him, because I'm not really looking for any more deals with safety. Okay, now let's just, let's just give him a whole dollar. He's only asking for pennies, so why not? Come on, we want to pay out. Uh, a key? Yeah, that's useful. Uh, I already got a skeleton key. I can open any door I want to. And a heart. Okay, that was actually very useful. Thank you. Come on. Man, you're just sucking me dry, man. Uh, bomb. Okay. Uh, the other battery, the 9 volt. The 9 volt actually, uh, I think it doubles how quickly items recharge after. So, I pretty much got unlimited uses on this food. So, Monster 2 isn't that hard to do, you just have to bait him into firing And it's relatively easy. As long as you don't push him too far to the sides. Oh god. Okay, well, as long as he doesn't do that again. And I was saying, Monster. Oh god. Okay. I would I said I would get to mom, I said I would kill mom, and that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do it, I swear guys. This will not be a failure. Alright. Oh god, no, 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 no. No! Oh, I'm so close. Okay. Well, I hope you enjoyed it guys. If you liked it, leave a like. Uh, please subscribe if you'd like to see more. And if you didn't like the video, I hope that the trolls meet you in the middle of the night to steal you away.